to uh, uh, lab of Cisco ISDN. I'm going to uh, show you how to connect uh, ISDN uh, to sites. Let's start in Boson. Go to NetMap. And you can find the uh, BRA interface only in five to, uh, uh, 2500 series and 800 series router. We'll use uh, one router for 2500 series. We're gonna give a name for R0. And second, we'll choose uh, a router uh, 800 series. And we're gonna give a name for R1. Okay, now we are going to connect these uh, routers via ISDN links. It will ask which uh, interfaces would you like to uh, connect. I'm going uh, to ask to router 0 BRI interface with router 1 BRI interface. Okay, here is uh, it going to uh, give us um, like um, uh, basic switch type and uh, dial numbers and speed and the uh, same is the other side of the router okay I'm gonna print this a green so we could remember this one and minimize this and I want to go my paint so I could remember this um, paste in front of me save as at my desktop uh, with JPG okay G switch types and okay here we go and if we go to our uh, desktop I can find this one uh, okay here it is and in front of me now it will be easy for me to uh, configure the ISDN now okay first of all let's load this lab in our simulator yes okay it's gonna give uh, us a, a little time to load the routers the both routers and after these routers both are loaded we can see the both routers from here first of all we'll uh, go to router r0 and enable count t i'll give a host name to this router r0 okay and uh, i'll definitely go for interface bri bri0 and gonna give a ip address 192.168.0.1255.255.255.0 okay and uh, definitely write it and now I'm gonna on router R1 okay enter and enable count T host name will be router 1 and definitely be alright 0 IP address uh, it will be 192.168.0.2 24-bit mask enter and it's both sides are uh, give we give IP addresses but not you can figure any kind of uh, ISDN so first step you have to go back on router 0 and show IP interface brief if you see there is a BRI interface we give a IP address to this um, 192.168.0.1 and it's uh, physical and protocols both are down yet okay go on config T and interface BRI 0 first of all we are gonna configure the switch type ISDN switch uh, switch type basic dot NI and ISDN speed 1 will be our the side of this one will be three and if i could uh, maximize this one and come to me a little bit like this so we could see this one okay a little more okay here it is and i'm gonna configure speed one is three two one seven seven eight two zero zero one zero one double zero enter okay uh, and uh, no shut down okay the interface is up same thing we are gonna on router one and show IP interface brief I see here is conf T interface BRI zero 
uh, ISDN switch type switch type will be basic dot ni and speed ISDN speed speed 1 will be 321-77-8200-201-00 and enter and then no shutdown okay here it is both BRI interfaces are up so now we'll go for save and we'll see show IP interface brief if you see the both sides are up if you're gonna give a ping 192.168.0.1 okay it will not come yet because we haven't give uh, uh, any kind of dial up dial number yet so go on a router one and write conf t and make a dialer list first dialer list uh, dialer one protocol ip permit and now we'll give this dialer list on an interface of bri interface bri zero dialer group one and enter okay if this side is configured for the dialer list and dialer group now we're gonna give a uh, dialer map ip the destination ip on the other side 192.168.0.2 name is r1 and it will ask for broadcast 7782001 the router once this number should be the other side if you are gonna dial my number you have to dial my number if you're gonna talk with me on phone not dial instead of your own okay this is the dial number of router r1 okay it's done well, now we'll go for the other side of this router we're gonna save it and we'll go for on router uh, one definitely will be a dialer dialer one list IP protocol IP permit enter interface BRI zero and here we'll give a dial dialer group one enter and uh, dialer map IP 192.168.0.1 and name is R0 bro broadcast 7782002 and enter okay now we'll check for show IP interface brief sorry show IP interface brief okay and both sides is up ping 192.168.0.1 will go so the success rate is 100 percent from one side and we'll go for the second side here and pink 192.168.0.2 enter and success rate is 100 percent okay this was our uh, isdn lab and uh, hopefully you will enjoy this one and you will do uh, a lot of practice on netboson for isdn and until now, bye-bye.